Hey everyone, it's Tasia. Welcome back to my channel. So we're going to be doing a plan with me for the week of Monday, August 14th through Sunday, August 20th. And I'm not going to be using kind of like the themed kit that I always do. I'm going to be, I plucked out a whole bunch of different sheets from my stash. I hope I pulled out all the ones that I want, but I have a lot of random stuff and then I'm going to be using my functional kit which will help me kind of keep a nice cohesive color theme. Oh, I hope. We'll see how this goes. <laughs> I'm going to try and do a live plan with me so things have just been super crazy and last week I was like, well I can't do a live plan with me because you know, my I'm just such a scatterbrain. When I have too much going on, I have to write everything down. And I was like, I'm gonna say things that are wrong, so let me do a voiceover. And then I was watching the playback. I was like, you guys, I just said so many things wrong. I was like, I might as well just do a live plan with me. Um, so that's what we're gonna be doing today. If funny things come out of my mouth and I don't realize it until it's already up and I'm watching the playback, then you can just laugh along with me while, <laughs> and just sorry. So anyways, Let's get started. This is a clear indication of how this video is going to go. So I'm using my Erin Condren Hourly Planner and one thing that I want to adjust, well, maybe I won't adjust it. Usually I white this out and I put the date covers up top, but I think I'm just going to set the date covers just slightly lower. So these look different than the normal date covers that I use because in the weekly kits they're like big pieces. These ones, they're two separate pieces. Uh, well, I mean the other ones are two separate pieces, but you know what I mean. It looks it's definitely different So I'm gonna put down the little flags first And again with the hourly planner um, It's not a perfect fit when it comes to the stickers because the columns are just slightly wider uh, Than say the vertical planner, so I just like to kind of slightly center them uh, so they don't look they're not completely centered to I mean off-centered so Let's put these down first The only thing about this You know what I'm gonna do is I'm just gonna wipe these times out so that way I don't need to push them completely over and Of course Zach is texting me as soon as I get started in my video I wonder if I can respond from my watch. I don't know where my phone is. Let's see. And you guys can watch me do this. <laughs> I'm just going to tell him nope. He wants to know if I need anything from the office. <gasps> this is working pretty good. All right. That's cool. Okay, so back to planning. Let's put down the Tuesday. So it has been just a f crazy week. Today is Saturday the 12th. So, oh my God, the dog just scared the crap out of me. <laughs> Do you hear them barking? Oh my gosh. I don't know what they're barking at, you guys. They bark at anything. They're like the boy who cried wolf. I just don't believe them anymore. And one day it's gonna be something important that they're trying to alert me. I'm gonna be like, yeah, right. Oh, that's kind of off. Oh well. So we have that down and then let's move on to the sidebar. So I don't have too many things for the sidebar. I really wanted to leave this sidebar pretty open um, just so I could make like a running to-do list because I have a lot of things going on right now and the more space that I can write, the better. So one thing I definitely am going to use is a hydration sticker because I have been terrible at drinking the water that I need. So I'm just going to put that right on the dotted line. Uh, a little off. Like that. And then I'll do some habit trackers as well and then the rest of the boxes I can just leave. This is a really pretty color scheme. It's definitely different than my usual go-to which is pinks and purples and that type of thing. I'm just grabbing whatever color. They all kind of, they all complement each other. So we have those and then let's get a header. Mm, and let's put make it say to do. I 
And you know what? In order to scoot this down, I think I'm going to use two headers, a blank one and then the to-do. This layout is going to be a bit more functional than my usual. I like to think that my normal layouts are pretty functional, but this is going to be more of a white space, kind of. Okay, so now that we have that, that is my sidebar. So done there. <laughs> that was really easy. And then let's move on to this column here. So this past Friday, so we've been doing Freebie Fridays, and this Freebie Friday, I love this sheet. This sheet needs to become a regular. I just need to make it a little bit bigger, but it's all about coffee. And so I can relate to every one of these little quotes. <laughs> I really like the little zombie, especially uh, with Halloween right around the corner. But I'm going to put this big Life Begins After Coffee sticker for Monday. Oh. Getting another text message. I am seriously not this popular. I don't know why everyone is texting me all of a sudden. <laughs> but it's my realtor let me, let me answer her back hang on okay so we have that sticker down you guys it's always when I'm filming or if it needs to be quiet all these things start popping up like the only people who ever text me is Zach and my sister <laughs> I don't know anybody else but now that I have the realtor in the mix I feel like like oh my gosh my my phone is buzzing. <laughs> so what are we going to put down next? Let's put a header and we'll get a to-do list started because Monday is going to be crazy. We are, um, I don't think we have anything going on for the home this week. We've been working on paperwork with the underwriter, which is so much fun. <laughs> I hate working with underwriters. They just ask for everything in the kitchen sink and then you give it to them, which is no problem. I understand they have to like do their due diligence, but you send it to them and then they just ask the same question over again. It's like, um, hello, <laughs> I think you need a planner, <laughs> write this down. So that's what my life has been like lately. Yesterday we did our inspection for the house and it was good and nothing bad came back, which is nice. Uh, and yesterday it just seemed like such a good day like everything was just falling in line and uh, I Was getting ready to go and I guess my neighbor hired a gardener but I don't know I've never seen him before but he was so friendly and just it like brightened up my morning just him being so sweet and Just cheerful and so that put me off on the right start and then I went to go to Black Rock because Yesterday, I don't know why but they were giving away nine punches on a punch card for every drink that you got so I was like we're we're splurging today and we're getting a drink so I did that and then they accidentally made my drink wrong which was fine because all it was was that the milk alternative was almond milk instead of coconut milk and I would have taken it but instead they gave me a whole free um they gave me the almond one and it was like, here, just give this away and we'll make you a new one. They made me the new one and so I re-gifted the coffee at work, which seemed a little strange. I gave it to our neighbor and he's like, oh, okay. But it worked out well and I just, I don't know, it just, it was a good day. So anyways, let me, I'm going to white out all of the 7 o'clock hour because what I'm putting on the bottom here is this, a uh, sticker from the sticker sheet called mental health and what it is it's a little brain and it has like a rating from 1 to 10 and what I'm going to use it for is just like um, stress and anxiety level so I'm going to kind of see how that fluctuates throughout the week because I feel like a little roller coaster ride like I swing like a pendulum so I'm just going to put these down here and figure that out I don't know I feel like um, of course the day-to-day -day workload and things like that plays a huge role but I really feel like my diet plays a huge role and of course being a lady that time of the month plays a huge role I have like all these factors to consider and I really just want to kind of hone in and see what the heck makes me feel so like oh my god like so disoriented some days I just I cannot 
focused some days. I just, I don't know. Do you guys ever have those types of days? Like some days I am laser focused. I can get a ton done. I don't need a to-do list and I'm just like bam, bam, bam and everything is good. And then other days it's <laughs> like, a, I don't know. Things just don't play out the way I want them to. So I don't know. There has to be a reason. So I am going to get to the bottom of it. Because I know, I mean, definitely my diet plays a huge role in my mood and also the way I feel internally. And guaranteed it affects my everything else. I feel like it, it plays a huge role, so we'll see. Back to planning. <laughs> I feel like I overshare like so much. You guys are probably like, we do not need to know this, but oh well. So I put that down and then where's all those sticker sheets? I swear I'd lose my head if it wasn't attached to me. What I'm going to do here is I'm just going to put a little reminder. Seriously guys, I'm just trying to focus a lot on staying focused and streamlined but also self-care because I really don't think I can stay on the top of my game. If I don't take care of myself, I learned that one the hard way. At the, when I first started this business, it was like I just would go hard every day, and everyone around me was like, "You go, you need to take a break." I'm like, "No, I'm fine." They're like, "You're gonna burn out," and it's like, "No, I'm not." And I don't feel like I burned out, but I feel I don't know things I don't I'm not the well-oiled machine that I once was so we're going to be working on that I used to seriously wake up at about 3 30 in the morning and not go I would just work continuously until about 12 30 at night you guys it was nuts so I've made a real effort to make myself go to sleep and make dinner and all that kind of stuff So let's put this down. Speaking of dinners, you guys mentioned uh, that you guys would want to see like a cooking video. <laughs> I thought that would be really fun, but also really kind of crazy. I don't know how I would do it on a filming video because you guys, when I cook, I cook like it. It's crazy when I cook. Oh, this isn't going to fit. What do I want to do? I think I'm just going to scoot this one down. Because I like to cook on a really high flame. I don't know what it is, but I like to torch everything. I'm like, no, I'll cook faster if I just blast it. And it's in a wok, which heats up even hotter. But I don't know. It always comes out. So <laughs> I'm not going to change. But if everything isn't perfectly prepped, it goes downhill real fast. Like I lose control. So <laughs> anyways, we have Monday done. So Monday feels pretty open you have the nice big sticker there and then a nice two spaces to write lists and things and then the next one the 15th is Tuesday which is two dollar Tuesday so let me find where are you I have these stickers that it's a two dollar Tuesday sheet so this one you can only get on Tuesdays but it comes with these cute little banners and then Simon the sloth who's saying give me stickers I think is really cute so we're gonna put this down I'm gonna white out this seven o'clock I love the hourly planner because you really it doesn't confine me I can just put the stickers wherever I want I don't have like those three boxes that are messing me up or anything like that if you guys haven't tried it I really recommend it if you like this column t type of planning you don't need to use the hours. You can just white them out, cover them up, do whatever, or just ignore them. Uh, but I don't know. I've, it just works really well for me. I'm going to put that down. It needs to scoot over just a little bit more. I hope it doesn't pull the white out. Okay, good. So, not like there. And then we'll put Simon. $2 Tuesday usually starts on Monday night because I don't, everyone's on different time zones. So before I go to sleep on Mondays, I just set it up so that way it's ready to roll. 
So one little insider tip, if you guys ever order on Tuesdays, if you're able to order Monday night, your items will ship faster because we batch them out in days. And so Monday is typically a smaller production day than Tuesday is, so these ship relatively quick and then Tuesdays are large days uh, so by the time everything is produced and packed and everything it's like Friday Saturday so while Monday's orders would have went out maybe Wednesday Thursday so you get a jump on it it's not that big of a deal but if you guys like your stuff super quick that is what I recommend so anyways let's wipe this out too even though I think I'm going to put a translucent box sticker like that and hopefully on Tuesday I'll be able to get some grocery shopping done so what I'm gonna do is I'm going to this one here this is also from I don't know why I have so many two dollar Tuesday sticker sheets in this spread but anyways this is another two dollar Tuesday mix and or maybe this changed I don't know. I'm pretty sure it's a $2 Tuesday mix. But anyways, it has this cute little narwhal who's available on a single sheet. Uh, but he's grocery shopping. So I'm going to put him there because we are in desperate need of food. And today is Saturday, so I'll probably shop tomorrow and then again on Tuesday. We've been trying to keep as little in the house as possible so that way things stay really clean. Hmm. I don't know. Keeping the house clean kind of stinks. <laughs> We have to keep it really clean because we're showing it and ugh, it's such a pain in the butt. But anyways, I it's okay. It'll only be for a little while longer. So now we're gonna put down this to-do sticker and I'm gonna put a full box to do. And let's match up the color. So it's this one here. All of these sheets, they come in a functional bundle. So you get the 10 sheets instead of buying them singly. So it saves you a lot of money. I think, oh, I did the math before. Like the bundle is $25. And if the top of my, if my memory serves me right, if you were to buy all the sheets singly, it would be like $39.50. So you're saving a good chunk. Just gonna scoot that down a little bit. It was a little crooked. Like that, I really like this. Oh great, my battery's about to die. <laughs> we'll get as much as we can and then I'll charge it. So if there's a rough cut in there, because my camera pooped out on me. I think I'll put another header. And Tuesday is also Taco Tuesday, so I'll put a little cute taco sticker down here. I'll just white all of these out because I don't know what's going on here. And where are you? It's so looking for these quarter boxes. And I'm just using this to layer. I'm gonna put that one down first, and then I'm gonna put this little Taco Tuesday sticker on there. Like that. And then what can we put here? Oh, you know what I, you guys, since we're grocery shopping on that day, I'll also clean the refrigerator out. Cause that's another thing. I don't know if people peek in my fridge when they're in the house. It's kind of creepy to think about, but I wouldn't be surprised. I People are nosy. <laughs> so I'm putting down the clean refrigerator sticker and then I'll put another header there just so it covers up and elongates this box a little bit. Like that. And then you know what? Actually, I'll scoot this little fridge up just a bit. Perfect. Okay, so now we're on to Wednesday. So Wednesday, let's start with this header that's on my finger just so we can get it off. 
And let's use one of those full length page flags. We'll use the same color. And I just make sure that it covers all the hours on there. Keep your eyes peeled for cute Christmas print. Seriously, you guys, people are texting. I never get text messages. I don't know what she's talking about. Cute Christmas print of what? Okay, so have that down. And then let's, oh my gosh, you guys, one other thing I need to do is schedule an appointment for the dentist. It's that time again. Just a cleaning and x-rays probably. They've been sending text messages and phone calls and postcards. They're like so persistent, so I'm using this sticker here. I really should be using an itty bitty version. You know what, I'm gonna use an itty bitty version. Let me bust out my box here. You guys, this box is out of control. I wish I could zoom out and sh let me see if it'll zoom out. <laughs> of course, the camera died right when I was zooming out. So this is the regular size and then this is the itty bitty. So the itty bitty is just gonna fit a lot nicer. Put that right there like that. And then we will move on down the road. Put that over there. Gosh, you guys, my desk is turning into a huge mess. Where'd my whiteout go? <laughs> oh man. Okay, so what I'm I'm just gonna white out these hours here really quick. It's just so much easier if we just cover them up. Even if a sticker is gonna cover it. I don't need to think about it. So we have that down, and then let's put another header just to kind of break things up, and let's use a really light colored one. Like that. And we're gonna use this Girl Tweeze Those Brows sticker, cause let's be real. It's got to happen. Okay, and now, you guys, we're going to speed things up a little bit. I really tried to do the life plan with me, but I'm terrible at holding a one-sided conversation for so long. I felt like I was starting to drift. So here I am, refreshed and ready to go. Uh, so I am putting down the mental health stickers again across the bottom, and then the date covers. Again, the date covers are a two-part sticker. You have the numerical portion, and then the day of the week, so it spans the width of the box. And then I'm just going to lay down some more decorative stickers. For Thursday, I'm going to use another sticker from the, um, what's it called? The Coffee Freebie, and it says Rise and Grind. I really like that one with the little beans. I think they're so cute. I could use a whole sheet of those, uh, which if you guys would too, definitely let me know. I can put it together. Uh, I put the little weekend banner. I just made sure to white out the hours because that definitely would have gotten in the way. And then I'm going to be putting down some to-do lists. I feel like a lot of stuff is going to be going on towards the tail end of the week. We have our monthly subscription boxes that are going to be open up, opening up, which are slightly different than the mystery boxes. The monthly kits, you get your monthly kit and your monthly overview the same ones that would become available in the shop on the 5th of every month. And you'd be signing up for November. I cannot believe you're signing up for November already. Um, so the kits get mailed out two months in advance. So that's why uh, November is coming. But anyways, I'm just going to be putting down some more little stickers here and there. I use the little otters because uh, I'm hoping we'll go out and do something fun on Friday. And then I'm using the subscription sticker to signify to myself to revamp the website to reflect it. 
Uh, I also have that new little sticker that says clean out your purse. My purse is a wreck because anytime we get mail, I feel like I just fling it all in there. So that way, if someone comes and sees the house, they don't see our, our private mail and it's starting to get a little out of control. Uh, for Saturday, I'm so sorry, it's out of view, but I put a little quote on there that says if it requires pants or a bra, it's not happening today. So <laughs> I'm hoping Saturday will just be a total relaxed day. So I'm using the binge watch sticker. I modified that little Simon the Sloth sticker to, I just cut out the hermit day. It's from the celebrate the day October. And then I'm just going to fill in Sunday. But that is about it. I hope you guys enjoyed the video. If you did, definitely give it a thumbs up. And until next time, I'll talk to you later. Bye.